New York, Iris Apfel, a textile expert, interior designer and fashion celebrity known for her eccentric style, has died. She was 102. Her death was confirmed by her commercial agent, Lori Sale, who called Apfel, extraordinary. No cause of death was given. It was also announced on her verified Instagram page on Friday, which a day earlier had celebrated that Leap Day represented her 102nd and a half birthday. Born August 29, 1921, Apfel was famous for her irreverent, eye-catching outfits, mixing haute couture and oversized costume jewelry. A classic Apfel look would, for instance, pair a feather boa with strands of chunky beads, bangles and a jacket decorated with Native American beadwork. With her big, round, black-rimmed glasses, bright red lipstick and short white hair, she stood out at every fashion show she attended. Her style was the subject of museum exhibits and a documentary film, Iris, directed by Albert Mazels. I'm not pretty, and I'll never be pretty, but it doesn't matter, she once said. I have something much better. I have style. Apfel enjoyed late-in-life fame on social media, amassing nearly 3 million followers on Instagram, where her profile declares, more is more and less is a bore. On TikTok, she drew 215,000 followers as she waxed wise on things fashion and style and promoted recent collaborations. Being stylish and being fashionable are two entirely different things, she said in one TikTok video. You can easily buy your way into being fashionable. Style, I think is in your DNA. It implies originality and courage. She never retired, telling, today. I think retiring at any age is a fate worse than death. Just because a number comes up doesn't mean you have to stop. Working alongside her was the honor of a lifetime. I will miss her daily calls, always greeted with the familiar question. What have you got for me today? Sales said in a statement, testament to her insatiable desire to work. She was a visionary in every sense of the word. She saw the world through a unique lens, one adorned with giant, distinctive spectacles that sat atop her nose. Apfel was an expert on textiles and antique fabrics. She and her husband Carl owned a textile manufacturing company, Old World Weavers, and specialized in restoration work, including projects at the White House under six different U.S. presidents. Apfel's celebrity clients included Estee Lauder and Greta Garbo. Apfel's own fame blew up in 2005 when the Metropolitan Museum of Arts Costume Institute in New York City hosted a show about her called, Rara Avis, Latin for, Rare Bird. The museum described her style as, both witty and exuberantly idiosyncratic. Her originality is typically revealed in her mixing of high and low fashions, Dior haute couture with flea market finds, 19th century ecclesiastical vestments with Dolce and Gabbana lizard trousers.